first. Okay, so here is the elevator at, uh, what's this building's name? I don't even know. Yeah, fi oh yeah, 500 Main Street, that's what it US2. is. Yeah, this is on 500 US2 in Iron Mountain, Michigan. Has classic leveling and I think it has a door bumper on it too. There's no door closed, there it is. That's the door bumper. These are harder to open on Otis's by far. Up to five, there's a little arrow. My second working Otis Lexan 50s Lexan elevator. Goodness. Thing makes some weird noises. I think I know why. It probably has chains underneath it. This is another traction elevator. Here we are on the fifth floor. If you want to get out, do it now because the door's going to try to close. Yes, yeah, so now we're going to get a look at the cab while we're still up here. There's the Otis logo. It's a really, really small cab. Average size for your 50s elevator, though. We'll look at this capacity is 2,000 pounds. And there's your attendant service buttons. These don't do a thing because keys aren't enabled. They use the uh, stop button as a door hold button, actually, in a lot of hospitals. And oh, there's the Otis capacity plate up there. 2,000 pounds. Anyways, we're gonna go back down to B again. Because you always take two rides. Anyways, I hope it's gonna go. It should. There we go. Two rides, why? Why does it say? Two rides, why? I always take two, especially on things like this that are really old. If you'd like to get off, you can go ahead. We gotta watch that classic leveling when, uh, when we go back up. I'm gonna only take one more ride just up to the top, and then we're gonna go down to the bottom, or not bottom, uh, go down the one and end the video. We're stopping. Uh, going up? Yes. Okay, what floor would you like? Third. Three! Anyways, we'll have to watch the classic leveling in five. Anyways, we're going up to three this time. Yeah. Yeah, I make elevator videos. I don't know what I hear today is. Yep. Here's third floor. Anyways, now we push five. Oh, it closes right as soon as you let go of door hold. This thing is completely original, not even modified safety sensors. see that very well. It goes fast. Yeah. I, I really don't like how quickly that door closes. And I think it's interesting how that door bumper just shoots out, unlike Dover. It's, it works a little differently. Anyways, we're going to go just down to one this time. There's the arrow. This is kind of hard to look at because it's so high up. Yep, he's getting back on, I think. Coming down. Hi guys. <laughs> Hi. I was trying to figure out what day that attorney is here. Like, Anyways, watch. There's the mm -hmm. door bumper Check. that comes Maybe out. The, and there's the little Maybe arrow. Stairs, uh, the bankers yeah. right now. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to watch Does the classic leveling once we get to one. Machine tells you anything? Anyways, let's see if we can see yeah, it. Just a little bit. Yeah. Anyways, you might want to jump out because the door is going <laughs> to close up. Yeah, I've never seen an Otis with a door bumper. That's quite neat. Anyways, there's the hall station. And we'll get a little look at the, the lobby area that we can look at in the lobby area. There's not much to see around. You can go through. Yeah, you can go through. I and mean, there might even be oh, just a staircase. No service elevator. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I guess uh, we'll just end the video now after we look at the elevator doors or whatever, and that's it.